is making his way to the octagon and looking to leave as the new UFC light heavyweight champion. He is the number one ranked 205 pound contender and is finally realizing the title fight here tonight. He believes he has a lot of advantages in this fight. He believes he's the better man. Look at the confidence on his face. No UFC jitters for this man. He is out to prove tonight that this champion is a one trick pony and that he is the best light heavyweight on the planet. We'll see if he can turn those words into actions here in short order. Challenger here tonight, though. A lot of people think we're getting a new champion. The champion is not among those. We'll see if this man can walk out the same way he walked in as the undisputed light heavyweight champion of the world. Our tale of the tape for this light heavyweight title fight. Adesanya is three years his senior. The rest of the numbers are nearly identical. Now to get us started, the veteran voice of the Octagon, Bruce Buck. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the Octagon, Eve Loving. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold out Toyota Center in Houston, Texas. It's time! Five rounds for the undisputed UFC Light Heavyweight Championship of the World. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, holding a professional record of 27 wins, three losses, and one draw. He stands six feet three inches tall, weighing in at 205 pounds. Fighting at a Bruno Czech Republic, introducing the challenger, Yuri Ganisa Kosciuszko. And now introducing the champion, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, holding a professional record of 20 wins, one loss. He stands six feet four inches tall, weighing in at 200 pounds. Presenting the reigning, defending, undisputed UFC light heavyweight champion of the world, Israel, the last style bender, Alessandro. UFC belt on the line, guys. Protect yourself at all time, obey my command at all time. If you want to touch love, do it now, go back to your corner. It's good to have you with us from Houston, Texas tonight inside Toyota Center. And this is the site of one of your biggest and, and I know most signature wins of your career against Gus back in 2015. One of the biggest fights of my life was when I beat Alexander Gustafson at UFC 192 when I retained my championship in one of the hardest fights of my entire life. The Toyota Center is a great fight. Big ball punch land. Dude's hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. Oh, he might be out. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. 
nice kick landed by this gentleman. Cable inches right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Adesanya gets touched by that kick there. Wow. All right, he closes the distance, gets the single collar tie. Well, he continues to find the openings tonight. Beautiful connection with the punch there. Accuracy at its best. Oh, nice jab. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Oh, beautiful hook. Oh, beautiful strike there by Israel Adesanya. He's got a lifetime in the game, not a lifetime in the UFC, but you see, this is a lifelong striker who is very dangerous with all of us. Yeah, and when you're standing with Izzy, you're in trouble, man. You're under constant attack the whole time because you never know when he's going to hit you. Oh! And just like that, the fight is over! Wow! Wow! What a fight! Yeah, there's another one for the highlight reel, and that's probably as good a knockout as he's had in the UFC. Just a perfect shot to end the fight. Crowd absolutely loving it. Flush land to close out his opponent. I'm not even sure the other fighter saw it coming, so a big knockout for him here tonight on the biggest of stages. And there is the UFC light heavyweight champion. This has long been the UFC's glamour division. And man, did he get it done with style points here tonight. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve Levine has called a stop for this contest. At two minutes, 58 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by knockout and new. So how about that? We got a new UFC light heavyweight champion, and he looks like he might retain this title for some time, DC. I mean, when you can come through this division, when you can beat all the great fighters at 205 and become the champ, your name will ring bells across all sports. And tonight, this guy became a star.